the real squid works. <laughs> really? Do another drift. Feels like Groundhog Day. You can probably hear that wind behind me. It's probably a good 15 to 20 knots at the moment. So, yeah, very, uh, very rocky on the way out. But uh, yeah, Mother Nature just hasn't been kind to us. So, um, oh, almost lost my footing there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we've just Andy and I have just punched it out, and um, just going to do a quick half day on the water um, and see what's what's going on. We're going to put a few squid tracks lures down. And might even throw some other jigs down and see how we go. So don't really have too many expectations so yeah set the bar low and hopefully we get a surprise <laughs> stay tuned there we go just a couple little blips there's probably three fish just sitting above 58 meters there and there's a couple of fish just hugging really tight so not a lot of structure gonna have to be pretty accurate with this drop so I'll try and line it up and keep the engine on in reverse and um, see if we can sit right on top of them There we go. Oh, he's still fighting, eh, this guy? Nah, all good, buddy. There we go. First fish out with Andy. <laughs> uh, first spot we went to had no fish, so yeah, just dropped this 150 gram pink uh, squid looking thing. <laughs> squid tracks, as you guys are probably aware. And this good mid sized nanny coming now, it's uh, pretty stoked. Pretty woolly conditions out here, but uh, Andy and I were just sort of sick, and sick of uh, being at home, stuck at home, so we've decided to punch it out in these conditions. So, woo! Alright, we're gonna do another drift, mate. a little bit of color oh it's just a small nanny oh well it's okay Whew. oh beautiful <laughs>
something's nailed it on the drop. Yeah, something's nailed it on the drop. <laughs> Crazy. That line just sped out quicker than normal. They're hungry. Woo. Yes, go Andy. Go Andy. Woohoo! Watch where you're going. <laughs> you gotta do your drag up, buddy. <laughs> what have you hooked the Loch Ness Monster? There we go, little nanny. Off he goes. Just cut. Watch your fingers, alright? Watch your fingers. Oh no, he's a good fish. Wow. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, baby. Woohoo! Nice nanny. My five, buddy. <laughs> Another cracking nanny here. <laughs> yeah, just um. Andy had a little bit of line tangle before and then we just did another drift and then uh, this beautiful fish just jumped on so yeah absolutely no complaints you're liking the uh, pink uh, nomad squid tracks at the moment so yeah pretty cool be nice if this wind died down a bit <laughs> awesome all right let's go do it do it again got him this time that's a better fish Andy Woohoo! Nice mate! <laughs> oh yeah! Hang on to this one buddy! It's nice and smooth! Yeah, nice! Woohoo! This could be a big nanny or a big red! Should be a good fish man! Must be a nice nanny I reckon! Could be your PB! Could be your PB. <laughs> nice, Andy. Yes, <laughs> monster. Walk back for me. Come back. That's it. Nice. Woo! <laughs> There's a good one. Oh, three, two, one. Let's get him in, buddy. Woohoo! Nice, Andy. Thank you very High much. High five, mate. Nice. There we go. Andy's got a big smile on his face. This is a uh, PB nanny guy, large mouth nanny. So, yeah, what'd you get it on? Uh, squid. Squid this time. 10-4. Yeah, well shows you like Andy got some nice squid here the other day that he caught off just sort of the mainland. Um, just a tiger squid. 
and you can see that I'm using uh, the squid trexes, but um, Andy's Andy's picked me today. He's um, he's got the, the largest nanny guy for the day, so just shows you sometimes the fish just can't resist the real thing, eh? <laughs> nice work, buddy. Good. All right, Thank you. all good. There we go. The real squid versus the squid tricks. <laughs> Andy's uh, proven that the real squid works. <laughs> He's nailed the biggest one for the day. So nice work, buddy. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, it's a little trout. Bashi. <laughs> little island trout. Nice, beautiful barchi. Beautiful spots in him. It's, uh, it's a 150 gram. Just using a 150. Oh no, it's a 130. Yeah, 130. Hey. <laughs> um, squid tracks, so yeah, pretty cool. All right, do another drift. Cheers, mate. <laughs> Well, after that big fish that Andy got, we decided to just pull the pin because it was starting to get probably closer to 20 knots more consistently out there in terms of the wind. So I thought we'd just play it safe and uh, I was getting a bit rock and rolly. So yeah, we just punched it back in. Um, yeah, you wouldn't think it's 20 knots out there, but uh, I guess the mountains and the, the cliffs behind us obviously block out a fair bit of the wind. So yeah, chalk and cheese. <laughs> But uh, yeah, pretty good fun. Um, it's always important to limit your catch. Uh, you know, we could have just stayed there and kept going um, and, and, you know, kept pulling in nannies, but, you know, we had a couple of fish between us, so we're pretty happy with that. So no need to go and wipe, them, wipe the whole school out. So yeah, um, just keep in mind this is a whole sustainability piece and keeping our oceans clean and so that our next generation can enjoy it. So yeah, awesome. Well, thank you so much for staying tuned, guys. We'll catch you on the next episode.